Hello, my name's Hayley Moyle and I'm from Hillstone Primary School and our school is part of the Ogden Trust Pilot Partnership. I'm here today to show you a demonstration based on the solar system and it's called Solar System in Your Pocket. Really easy one to do. All you'll need is one metre of till roll, some larger coloured circle stickers and some smaller coloured circular stickers and then some printed labels of the planets or the children can write the names of the planets onto their pocket solar system themselves. So here's one I made earlier and that is our end point for today's demonstration. So to start off with take your till roll and you'll need to create equal eights. So fold it in half, then in half again to create quarters and then in half for a final time to create the eighths. Open it back up. So our larger circular sticker, our yellow one, represents the sun. And I'm going to stick that and fold it so it comes halfway round. Now the farthest point of our solar system for today will be Pluto. So just draw a little black dot for Pluto. The next point to look at is we're going to have a think about Uranus. Now this is a great way to address some misconceptions that many children have about the solar system. Often students think that Uranus is really far away from the sun, one of the furthest planets because it's one of the final um, planets that they name. However, it is actually the middle distance between the sun, the centre of the sun and Pluto. Then working back from Pluto, if we count two eighths back, on that fold there we'll stick one of the larger stickers for Neptune. Pass Uranus, and from Uranus count another two eights, and then use another larger sticker for Saturn. Now I like to draw some rings around Saturn to represent the ice and dust. So then one eighth back from Saturn will be our final larger planet, the largest planet, which is Jupiter. And again, the children can be sticking their labels on or simply writing the names on. Then we're going to concentrate on the first eighth. This is where our inner planets lie. Fold that in half first of all. And this fold will become our asteroid belt. Then inside the asteroid belt, between the sun and the belt, we're going to use the smaller stickers to represent the smaller inner planets. So obviously closest to the sun we'll have Mercury, then Venus, Earth, and finally, Mars. So this is the end point of our demonstration. And you can see on the far side, I've got the larger yellow sticker representing the sun. Then the smaller stickers, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, and the asteroid belt. As we reach the first fold, the first eight, we've got Jupiter. On the next fold, you'll have Saturn. Your halfway point is Uranus. Two folds later, Neptune, then the furthest point in our solar system, Pluto. So on our end point here, we've actually had the children create some facts that they've added to the uh, stickers representing the planets. A fantastic resource for the children to fold up, pop in the pocket, take it home, share their learning with their family, stick it on the fridge, put it up in their bedroom. A great resource for them to reference when learning about the solar system.